this. It looks crispy. How does it look? Is it good? Shut up. It ain't lagging. Got the fiber. Got the fiber, man. Chat, listen, bro. I cannot explain how happy I am. It looks the same, LOL. Does it really? Does it really look the same? Chat, it looks the same? <laughs> really? You had me excited for nothing. What do you mean I got the fiber? Chat, why y'all trolling? Is it in 1080p though? You can watch it in 1080p. 1080p 60. Chat, do y'all want to do a speed test? This is not 1080p. Buddy, it's literally in 1080p. How you gonna tell me it's not? I can see that it's in 1080p. We just hit 10,000 subs. We just hit 10,000 subs! Whoa! 10,000! Do we keep this or go back to the hot spot? Look at it! I'm a new man! Who just said leaked weight? You're banned, buddy. You are banned. What you mean leaked weight? We want 4K now? How do I do it in 4K? This is what got us through up to this point. Three little hot spots. Three of them. That's it. Now it's time to say goodbye, chat. Buddy, I have skinny hands. What you talking about? Skinny and massive at the same time. Ice cream, ice cream! I was gimme, the gimme, first bite. gimme! Uh, no way! 18 minutes for a 97 gig game, bro. And that would have taken me 18 hours before. Yeah. We did it. And I'm happy! What's this? Once upon a time, there was a man named Case. Yeah, that's me. He was known for his love of fast food, yeah. especially McDonald's and Waffle House. Oh, yeah. He was also known for his weight. Okay, can we ban this dude? Which made him the target of constant teasing yeah. and roasting from his peers. Yeah. Case was also a Twitch streamer, and he often streamed himself eating copious amounts of fast food. What? To his audience, despite the criticism he faced. He remained unapologetic about his love for greasy, delicious food. It's good. However, there was one man who made it his mission to humiliate Case at every opportunity. Who? His name was John Pork, of or as he preferred to be called, Jonathan Pork. John was a fitness enthusiast and health nut who took great pleasure in ridiculing Case for his weight and eating habits. One day, Case decided he had had enough of John's taunts. He concocted a plan to steal all the food from his beloved McDonald's and Waffle House, hoping to draw John. Oh yeah, Chad, by the way, I ate McDonald's today. You wanna know what I got? Guess what I got? I'm gonna tell you anyway. I got a I got a 20 piece large fry, large coke, and three quarter pounders. Yep. I had to celebrate getting fiber. John out and confront him once and for all, as he was making his getaway with bags full of burgers, fries, and waffles. Yeah. He heard the unmistakable sound of John's voice shouting. Stop right there, you fast food fiend. Case I'm not a fast food fiend! Okay, maybe I am a little bit. Dude, fast food is good. What you want me to say? Y'all about to sit here and act like you don't like fast food like that? Chad, if you had the option to eat fast food every day, would you? Yes or no? Be honest right here. I see a lot of yeses, and those are people who are actually being honest. Anybody who's saying no is just trying to be different. Anybody who's saying no are just people who's trying to be different. Okay? That's just it. Chat, li chat, listen. I got a 20-piece large fry, large Coke, three quarter pounders because I had to celebrate. I had to celebrate getting fiber today. I had to treat myself to some McDonald's. Turn to face John, who was charging towards him with a look of pure fury on his face. The two engaged in a heated argument with John berating Case for his unhealthy lifestyle. My lifestyle and isn't unhealthy, I have a six pack. Case firing back with insults about John's obsession with fitness. As the argument escalated into a physical altercation, Case realized that his size was actually an advantage. What? He climbed onto the back of a passing truck 
which was transporting goods to a nearby warehouse and rode away from the scene. John was left standing in the middle of the street. Fuming with anger and frustration, he had been foiled once again by the wily and resourceful Case. From that day forward, Case continued to stream his fast food binges on Twitch, and John continued to criticize him. But Case didn't care. He knew that he was living life on his own terms. Yeah! And enjoying every bite of his delicious, exactly. greasy food. Chat, listen, you can judge people all you want to, but at the end of the day, if somebody's happy sucking down 15 donuts a day, eating fast food all day, hey, you know what? Do what you want to do. And who knows? Maybe one day he'll get his own revenge on John. I will. By challenging him to a Big Mac eating contest. Ooh! Yo, chat, be honest with yourself right here. How many Big Macs do you think you could eat in one sitting? Just the sandwiches. And a drink of your choice, right? How many do you think? Like, be realistic. How many do you think you could eat in one sitting? Three? Seven, Kulo? Excuse me? Four? Five? If I'm being honest and I haven't eaten in an entire day, I could probably put down five or six of them things. Now you put some hot dogs in front of me. I'm sucking down at least probably. Hot dogs? I'm probably sucking down. Dude, I'm saying 10 plus on the hot dogs. This is Tux. He tattooed my name on his leg. The one by one Lego piece. Yo. Man. Dude, that's on you forever, dude. Bro, that you realize that's on you forever and ever now. Like, it's never going away. You know what I mean, chat? That's never going away right there. Is this a new PFP? Chat, is this a new PFP? Is this the Twitter PFP right here? Dude, why is he so wide? <laughs> look, at, look at this dude. You know, you, actually, that's goals right there. I'm not going to lie. That's goals, dude. Like, seriously, that is goals, bro. Burger. Burger. Dude, I mentioned my Twitter, and I'm over here getting, like, 30, 50 notifications of people following me on Twitter. No way y'all didn't know I had a Twitter. Phone over here blowing up. Fellas, if you got a certain lady friend in mind, and you want her to fall head over heels for you, just use these four... Simple words and she'll fall for you. It works every time. Okay. It's worked for me in the past. Every time. Let me show you. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Where my hug at? Come on, where my hug at? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, you may call me crazy for this, but if you execute that right, that actually works. I know it's the whole meme of where my hug at. But if you execute that with that right, it can work. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Oh, no, I'm on the news again! No! Arkansas Officer Case O gets a raise. Ooh. Other workers said he definitely deserves this raise because yep. every day at work, we can hear him scream, you're under arrest. Yep. These are some clips of Officer Case O in action. Just, just we beautiful, beautiful. Show me your hands. This dude was reaching. I don't care what nobody says. This dude right here was reaching. He had a glove in the in the visor. Period. By the videos you can tell Queso is one of the best officers in Arkansas. In his total career, he has killed six people and sentenced life to over 15 inmates. Six people that you know of? Six? <laughs> six that you're aware of? <laughs> six? 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 Chad, if you had to guess... How many have I have killed in this game? It ain't no six. He means you ate the people? It's bare minimum like 
It's bare minimum like a hundred that I've taken out in this game. Not gonna lie. Like bare minimum a hundred. Yo, chat, you know what's crazy, by the way? Dude, I was watching YouTube the other day. I saw a uh, body cam video of a guy that got arrested for impersonating a police officer. This dude was driving around stopping people, and he wasn't even a cop. Like, dude, you have absolutely nothing to do if you're driving around acting like a cop, dude. Do anything else. Go home, play a video game or something. Spam! Heading towards the Burger King! This result might, this might result in a fatal, fatal car crash. Yo, that almost killed me. Case, what's your Wendy's order? 20-piece spicy and three of those ghost pepper ranch chicken sandwiches and like two orders of Baconator fries and a large Coke. Breaking news, a overweight streamer crashes. Did I just hear what I think I just heard? Breaking news, a overweight streamer crashes into a Waffle House in Goobertown, Arkansas. What is up with Goobertown? It's a real place? No way. Is Goobertown, Arkansas a real place? Are you serious? No way it's a real place. Is that how y'all see me, chat? Is this how you see me? Huh? Play a game? Your name is Chris, and I'm about to play a game. I'm not going to wake up tomorrow named Chris. You are. Relax, Chris. Okay, can you delete these off the internet? Get these deleted off the internet ASAP, okay? Get, get them out of here. Breaking news. As many know, the world has entered the dark ages. Energy of any type has been scarce around the world, thus leaving almost every nation without power. Government authorities look toward Queso. Why? An up and coming Twitch streamer, who is now officially being called humanity's last hope, as the world has run out of natural energy. Scientists have been on the lookout for anything they can use to power the world. That is when they stumbled across Queso's RV. In Goobertown, Arkansas, they discovered this location from the amount of energy being emitted from queso, specifically in his belly area. Scientists did a background report and concluded case has eaten 10 million tons of food. This sparked hope as it may be enough energy to restore the world. Military units quickly kidnapped case from his home and took him to an undisclosed location as they realized case could be the one who might restore the world. They quickly sedated his brain so he would not fight back or show any aggression. As you can see it clearly worked. This plan scientists <laughs> Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they lobotomied me. Yeah. Chat, they hit me with a lobotomy. Dude, they changed me. <laughs> hey. He might restore the world. They quickly sedated his brain so he would not fight back or show any aggression. <laughs> As you can see, it clearly worked. This plan scientists concluded would be to use Case's belly of energy as an atomic bomb which would help power the world again. They attached a device to Case's belly that would ignite the Case atomic bomb. Quickly they hauled Case into a cargo plan to be used as what scientists now call the Case Blast. Case and the team were now ready. Then the world and time stood still as Case was dropped. And just like that power was restored to the world. Now may we have a moment of silence for our lost hero, Queso. I was not born in 1959. K 
Queso's hotspot just commented and said, Why I'm better than Fiber? Why did you get rid of me? <laughs> I had to, bro. I had to. We, you know? Maybe we'll break out the hotspot like once every two years or something and do a hotspot stream. And welcome to the 12 o'clock news. Today is a sad day because today was the day that undercover agent John Pork killed local paycheck to paycheck streamer Queso in cold blood. We are unsure of his whereabouts, but he was last seen partying at Case's local waffle house where Case ordered 128,067 waffles all for himself. Yeah. He also paid for everyone's meals because he is a nice guy. I'm joking. He this dude just said I got five three minute ads. No, you didn't paid for everyone's meals because he ate them all. Hey Case, let's go to Zhao Island. Okay, bestie. Case, Why do I sound like that? I stand in front of the dry and I take a picture. It's okay to cry, daddy. Okay, Case. One, two, three. John Pork pressed a button that made the dragon breathe a ball of fire onto Case's head. Oh, that almost killed me. Oh. I'm sorry, Case, but I was never your friend. I'm with the CIA and I came here to investigate your 87 felonies at Waffle House. You have committed over the past 54 years. Case then rose from the fire. Yo, money man with 5,000 bitch chat. Give me some dobies for money man. Yo, money man, I appreciate that. And threw his waffle machine at John Pork, causing a chain reaction of five waffles shot at John Pork. Dude, waffles are so good. Yo, chat, listen. I think, dude, waffles are good with no syrup even. Like, sometimes I'll go to Waffle House, they'll just give me the plate of waffles, no syrup, just straight dry. I just suck them down dry. Nothing on them. You know what I mean? That's how good they are. Like, if they're done right, they're just, you just eat them how they are. You know what I mean? Like, they're good. Case woke up and realized it was all a dream. The end. Why does my bedroom look like this? What am I sleeping in? They need butter? I do agree. I do agree they need butter. Yo, you know, my, my friend Link, when we go to Waffle House, you know what he does with his waffles? He gets chocolate chip waffles. That's it. He don't put no syrup or nothing on them. He gets chocolate chip waffles and just eat chocolate chip waffles. Like, bro, you're nasty, man. What you mean, based? Waffles are good one way. Straight up waffle with some butter and some syrup on it. Period. End of discussion. Let's go! One, two, three! I had to click out of that first she started throwing cheeks though because I think they banned you for that she was probably about to start tossing cheeks so I had to cut it off before that happened because I think they banned you for that so what is this Case, what should I get from Taco Bell? Ooh, man. Chat, what are we thinking? What should he get from Taco Bell? Dude, I'm not going to lie, bro. Just don't go to Taco Bell. Taco Bell ain't good no more. Grilled cheese burrito? No, dude. The grilled cheese burrito was good the first 200 times I had it. Okay? Who just said the grilled cheese dipping taco was fire? The grilled cheese dipping taco was the worst thing they've ever came out with. You don't know what the best thing they ever came out with was? The steakhouse burrito like six years ago. Chat, do y'all remember the steakhouse burrito from like five, six years ago? That was the best thing that ever graced that menu. That was the that was the absolute best thing that they ever came out with. That steakhouse burrito, man. I still dream about it. Wake up in the middle of the night in a cold sweat thinking about it, man. That's it. That... What are we playing, chat? 
right now, by the way, if I get followed by helicopters, I'm probably just gonna leave. Chat, this is kinda peaceful. Just us alone on the mountain. Nobody running around calling me calling me big man. You know what I mean? Just us making it. Solo adventure. You know? Here's where I died yesterday. I'm going again. I'm trying it, Chad. I got to. I gotta try it again. No way! No way he found me! How did you find me? If you fall off, I'm not helping you. You understand me? You fall off, I'm not helping! Who just said that avalanche is for me? I'm the most experienced hiker here! Follow my lead! Bro's the most experienced eater? What? Ooh, gimme fry! Uh, stay case, stay close case, let my salty goodness guide you. <laughs> hey, hey, I'm ready. I'm getting nervous, Chad, I'm getting nervous. Oh my goodness, I'm getting nervous. The rope is breaking! Hey, you get out of my face and you walk that rope! Go! Loser! Good. Fix your attitude? Buddy, you walked up on me today and typed one word. Fat. You talk about fix my attitude. You wonder why I got an attitude. Huh? stopping full speed ahead nothing's gonna stop me nothing's gonna hold me ah hey are we like three-fourths of the way there are we almost there hey case is the ladder's biggest fear what do you mean by that what do you mean I'm the ladder's biggest fear? What are you trying to say, buddy? Look at me breaking away like the lone wolf alpha I am. Look at all, look at the look at the herd running towards me because they know I'm the lone wolf alpha of the group and they're nothing without me. Yo, everybody, be careful! If you, f dude, you gotta be careful, French fries. I need you alive. No! Ominous died! No! No way! Is Ominous up here? Did he make it? Ominous? Is he up here? Is he up here? He's not up here. He died. Matter of fact, let's call a meeting. Gather up. Gather up in front of me, everybody. Gather up in front of me. Stand in front of me. I'm calling a meeting. We're gonna. We're gonna. Um. Here goes out to Ominous. He was a good guy. I only just knew him, but uh, he's gone too soon. He was a good guy. So let's all gather up together. Pull through, okay? Let's pull through. R.I.P. R.I.P. to a real one, Chad. He was the only he was the only one I had. Case, I'll be your new ominous. Okay. Yo, Rez is gonna be our new ominous, Chad. Okay. He should have used your stomach as a landing pad. You're banned. I'm risking it! No! I'm about to get lost and starved to death. There's no way out. I just cooked. I just cooked. Wait, where's French fries? No, he's here. Look, he's here. French fries is here. We're good. Is this it? 
We made it! We made it! Yes! We're saved! A willing sacrifice for the greater good. He's dead and gone, but he's alive in our hearts. This one's for Ominous. Now we're going to the Waffle House, and that's the end of it. He doesn't have a proper burial, but he'll always be remembered. Somewhere down there, chat. Ominous is still on this mountain somewhere. Ominous is still on this mountain. That dude missed the plane. <laughs> chat, did y'all see that dude? That dude missed the plane. <laughs> hey, <laughs> yo. Hey, I'm hungry. Y'all got any McDonald's or something? That's where Ominous would be sitting, chat. Chat, that's where Ominous would be sitting. Should have been you. Shouldn't have been Ominous. It should have been you. Ominous should be in that seat, not you. Should have been you. It should have been you, not Ominous. Yes. Get these nerds! <laughs> Losers! We ain't picking you up! You ain't getting picked up! Deuces! Hey! Deuces! Add ominous? Did he send me a friend request? Did I miss it? Oh, he did send it. You know what, chat? I'll accept them. I accepted them. I did. I accepted ominous, chat. I did. You know what? I'll accept the french fry man, too. Who just said the plane is leaning to the right? Bro has four helicopters to support his weight. Chat, you really think I'm weighing it down? You really... Who just said triple XL plane? Can we get this new band? Where is the plane taking me? I know one of y'all brought me some Mickey D's. I know one of y'all did. Somebody better have a sack of Mickey D's. We made it! Hey, 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 group photo. Hey, group photo. Hey, everybody spread out. Group photo, selfie sign. Hey, selfie. Everybody spread out. Selfie. Hey, spread out. Selfie. Spread out! There's fries? Where? Where's the fries? <gasps> fries! <laughs> that made it all worth it. 